Hey everyone and welcome back to another Jazzy Wicks candle review. Today I am reviewing Woodwick for you. I don't know if you can see there because of the light. We've got Chili Pepper Gelato. So Woodwick is another um, arm of Yankee Candle. So Yankee Candle own Woodwick but it's just another brand that they do. This is actually the mini hourglass candle and the thing that I absolutely love, love about Woodwick's is that they crackle as they burn and they are very very loud um so you can see in there the wick isn't your normal cotton wick you've got the little bit of the wood wick sticking out there obviously i've not done anything to this since i last burnt it got the nice wood lid there these are a little bit more expensive um this one is online now actually for so this is 275 grams this one it's online for 10 pound which i don't think is that bad for the smaller ones um, I got. I actually bought this from Clinton Cards here in the UK, so mine was exactly the same price as it is online. But then you can get a medium hourglass, a large hourglass, or an eclipse candle. The eclipse is the one that I've had before, where it's um, a bit shorter and um, a larger shape. Obviously, not the hourglass. So the reason I got this, um, I was drawn to it because of the name. So chili pepper gelato, and I thought, oh. Not quite sure how I feel about that. I opened it in the shop and smelt it. And on a cold sniff, I don't think I've ever smelt a candle that's more of an authentic pepper smell than what this is. You really get, like, even on a cold sniff, I got, like, that spicy chilli smell. Like, you was making dinner and you was cutting up a red chilli or something like that. So, straight away, I was like, it's not something I would normally go for, but... I'm going to get it. I'm going to give it a go. Um, it's only £10. I'm going to put myself out there and get it. It's not something I normally like. So the top notes for this are lemon, sriracha and black pepper. Mid notes of vanilla bean gelato with coconut milk. And then a base of vanilla with crystallised sugar. This is such a peculiar smell. I do not know who thought of this i don't know who really looked at this smell and thought people are gonna want this don't get me wrong throw rating up there the throw rating is i'd probably say a nine or a ten out of ten um i had it burning in quite a large room and it filled the entire room my only thing is the scent notes. I find it really odd. It's the scent that is putting me off. But obviously there might be some people out there that absolutely love the notes in this. So a really amazing throw. And this is just the mini hourglass. It's £10, 275 grams. Um, it says as well, before I forget, that the burn time... Well, it actually says the burn time may vary on this. It doesn't actually say on their website what the burn time is for it, which is quite strange. It normally always says it. Um, oh, it doesn't say it on there either. Very strange. Yankee Candle website normally always shows it, but that's what I'm on now and it is not saying. I'll put it in the description down below. I'll have a little look after I've finished filming. So the notes from this, completely the same as on a cold sniff. If you smell this on cold and you like it, you're going to like it when it's burning. This was such an authentic pepper smell. But then you also did get the, the creaminess, the vanilla bean gelato and that vanilla come through as well. So it's really weird because in one in one instance, you're getting like the the sort of the black peppery spicy chili smell. And then the next smell, you're getting the, the vanilla gelato sort of scent. So it's a really weird combination for me. I just thought it was really strange. But yeah, definitely that's how I would how I would sort of explain it. If you smell this on a cold sniff and you like it, you're going to like it when it's burning. And it's a very lingering scent as well. It's it's not one of those ones where you walk into the room and then you can't smell it. I had it burning in my room and I'd put it on and I could smell it constantly throughout the whole evening. It's burnt nice and evenly. It didn't produce, well, as of yet, it hasn't produced any soot. But when I'm sitting there smelling it, even then just opening the lid, I can smell like that black pepper sriracha smell. But even as it was burning, I was sort of sitting there and one minute I was like, oh, I don't, I don't like that. It's got too much of a sriracha pepper, black pepper smell to it. I don't like it. And then I'd leave it going because obviously I needed to give it a fair review. And then I could smell the lovely vanilla creaminess of it. So really strange combination. I'd be interested to know if anyone else has tried this. 
and what you thought of it. I'm really glad I gave it a go and it is a really strange scent. I feel like you have to be really in the mood for this or really, really like the notes that are in it. But I'd like to say I enjoyed it because it was a strong throw. The actual scent of it isn't a scent I would buy it again. But like I say, if you are a fan of like those spicier sort of scents, the black pepper, the sriracha, the gelato and the vanilla, it all comes through in this. Definitely worth the money, 100%. And it's so refreshing to actually, I know it's Woodwick, so it's slightly different from Yankee Candle, but it's still Yankee Candle brand. So it's so refreshing to have a Yankee Candle that's actually performed that well. So really pleased with it as a performance. The notes, not for me. <laughs> it's very, very strange. But do let me know if you've had this and what you thought of it. I'm just not sure how I feel, but yeah, let me know. I'm definitely glad I tried it. Going to definitely, pro well, definitely get some more woodwicks after how well this has performed. I've had some before. There's a couple on my channel from a long, long time ago. Normally because they are a tiny bit dearer, I do avoid them because obviously I don't have all the money in the world to review all the candles I would love to review. But I just saw this in the shop and I'm glad I, I would never order this online. But because I was in the shop and I smelt it on a cold sniff and felt it was really interesting, I thought... I'll give it a go and I'm very glad I have great performer but very very specific scent you're gonna have to really like them notes to enjoy this so as always thank you for watching and I'll get some new reviews out for you soon